Hey, look, man, y'all already know what's going on. We is in the building. Y'all see the title. Y'all see the thumbnail. We in here talking about THF for the first topic. And then we talking about Boss Top and 051 for the second topic. So the first topic we talking about THF, j Dog and THF Shooter. So whole time, THF Shooter is running his brother account. His brother, THF Shooter, just got took out this shit. So whatever THF Shooter brother name is, he running his account. But this type of shit that he's saying on his account, he basically on there, he ain't worried about being looked at as a snitch because he on there just coming out with it and saying who killed his brother. And the person that, that he's saying who killed his brother is another THF member. So THF brother, I mean THF shooter brother is on shooter IG account and he's saying somebody named J Dog from THF, the one who killed his brother. And the other shit that he's saying is that all the four of them from THF know about it, but they still posting shooter picture. Like all the THF members is on their social media putting rest in peace shooter, posting his picture and all that shit. But his brother is saying like, y'all y'all was all in on the shit. That's what the brother of shooter is saying. He's saying y'all was all in on it. Y'all knew, God damn it, what was about to take place. Y'all damn near helped put the shit together, all type of shit. And the shit that shooter brother is saying, the reason why this shit happened to shooter is because I guess j Dog and some THF members felt like Shooter stole some watches. What's up with this watch shit? Lil Jeff with the watches, Vert with the watches. Now, Lil Zay Osama with the watches. Like, people dying over watches in the rack right now the whole time. You know, that's what the brother is saying that this situation about. They saying, he's he saying that j Dog them think that Shooter stole some watches. So, that's why shooter just got backdoor. J Dog just back just J Dog just backdoor shooter because he thought he felt like shooter stole some watches and shit like that. And the brother is saying that shooter ain't had nothing to do with that shit. So it'll be it'll be messed up whole time if shooter really ain't had nothing to do with the shit and y'all just took phone them out this shit. People acting like life ain't precious nowadays. I ain't gonna lie, like people be like on they death shit. Like, I don't know, but the brother is on some shit like, man, my brother ain't even take them watches. Y'all just did what, what y'all did for nothing. You know what I'm saying? And then y'all bogus, cause whole time, we all the same shit. And then all the folk them who posting his pictures, saying R.I.P. and all that shit, y'all fake as hell too. Y'all knew this shit was finna happen. But y'all putting on this image for the world to act like, no, nah, this our brother. And not like, that ain't y'all brother. Like, this what the the blood brother is saying. The blood brother saying all that love that you see being shown in the shooter on social media by other THF members, that shit fake. And, you know, it shit just crazy, bro. You know, I hopped on social media. I seen this shit. I'm like, damn, what's going on amongst THF? You might see Zeus speak on this shit, you know, Sometime today or tomorrow or soon, like you might see Zoo speak on the shit. Everybody knows Zoo, he the face of that shit. So, you know, I ain't gonna lie, fool. You got a lot of shit against you up in this shit. You got a 12, you gotta watch out for 12. You gotta worry about the people that you actually into it with from the other side. And then you gotta worry about your own people, bro. It's like a lot of shit against you nowadays when you win this shit. Like, when you in the field, you in the trenches. Like, you out here, you know, playing ball and shit. Like, your ass got them. You a part of all the bullshit. You got a lot of shit to worry about, like, when you up in this shit. Like, it used to just be the police and the people that you went to it with. Now you got to worry about your own guys type shit. And that shit been going on the whole time. It ain't, you know, ain't never been to this level. Like, it's at a whole new level nowadays. But, uh, you know, according to Shooter, he's saying that's what took place and shit like that. Y'all hop in the comments. Y'all let me know what y'all think about that situation. You know, um, y'all made it to this point. Make sure y'all smash the like button and say what number you is. Now, we finna talk about 
Boss Top, man. Boss Top and one of the 05 ones. So look, man. Everybody know Boss Top notorious for not knowing how to fight. The whole time, what's being said right now is Boss Top got one of his first W's, man. Boss Top got one of his first wins as far as fighting is concerned. Everybody knows Top, he locked up. He's been locked up for a minute now. I don't know when Top, top is getting out. But, uh, you know, he was locked up. He on the deck and all that shit. You know, I guess he uh, left up out his cell for a while to go do whatever. And when he got back, you know, he fi ended up finding out that, you know, somebody was stealing now, like stealing from his cell and shit like that. And it turned out to be one of the 05 ones slash Met Boys. I guess this particular person claimed both the shits. For the people who don't know, that's kind of like the same shit, but it's not. You know, 051, uh, Young Money, and the Met Boys, they, you know what I'm saying, they close, close niche, clicked up, whatever you want to call it. You know, some people look at them like the same shit, but they not really the same. It's like some old block 600 shit. You know, our old block of 600, they different shit, but, you know, some people look at it like they're the same. It's like that type of shit. So, you know, Top caught them stealing, and Top put the hands on them. And the whole time, what's being said is that Top came out on, uh, Top came out on Top, hell no. Nah. No, nah, real shit, though. Top came out on Top, you know what I'm saying? Like, for them, he ended up winning the fight and shit like that. And, you know, hey, man. You got to, you know what I'm saying? Like, shit. You know, in certain countries, you get your hands chopped off for stealing, man. So, dude, as you know, keep your hands to yourself, man. You know, for them, you know, had sticky fingers. I guess he tried to steal some of them shit, got caught, and got the hands put on them. You know what I'm saying? Like, shit, it is what it is, bro. You know, you, you're you already in jail. Now, now you still, look, you in jail for stealing, and the whole time, goddammit, it. You still stealing while you in jail. Like, you know, the whole time, I'm just talking shit. I don't know why I'm putting them in jail. Like, you probably in jail for some other shit, but that's crazy. Like, you still taking shit. That'd be, cra that'd be crazy, though, wouldn't it, if somebody went to jail for stealing and then they get caught stealing out of one of their uh, cellmates' cell and putting them beat his ass. Like, then they ask him, damn, why he beat you up? Because I was stealing up out his, uh, his commissary. And then the uh, CO like, damn, what, what, what? Ain't you in jail for stealing? You know, your ass a career, a career stealer. Like you've been stealing your whole life, man. But no, nah, man, top card, little, little young money. One of the little O five ones to put hands on them for stealing and shit like that. The real headline is top winning the fight. The headline ain't really about nobody's, you know, young one of the young money members stealing, like the shit that's blowing, you know, the shit that's catch people's eye in this situation, not that the dude from Young Money was stealing, is the fact that Boss Top won a fight. That shit is crazy. I can't believe Top won the fight. You know what I'm saying? That shit crazy, bro. He notoriously known for not knowing how to fight. So, you know, shout out to Top for actually winning, uh, a physical altercation but yeah man y'all let me know what y'all think about that situation in the comment section if y'all made to this point make sure y'all smash the like button and say what number y'all is drop location so we can shout out to where everybody from make sure you mess with all the links in the description from top to bottom and make sure you watch all the way to the end of the video so you can see all the top supporters of the channel you know and then at the bottom of the list it shows ways where you could be a top supporter of the channel and i could put your name on that list and you can have your shit sold up on every video that i drop with a stop next to your shit you know that's my way of showing paying my respects back to all my supporters and shit like that but look man shot right story podcast y'all already know what's going on i love y'all before y'all get up out of here do me the biggest favor and smash that like button man y'all already know what's going on some money, y'all. I'll be flexing when I'm drunk and shit. These bitches mad at me. They throw their phone, they be like, fuck this. Smoking big granddaddy. Look for them overstuff my blood and shit.